Saimi was established in November 14 in 2014. This means that the Institute is now celebrating a decade of existence as a partner to many stakeholders in growing the ocean's uh, economy. The Institute was established uh, through a partnership itself as an outcome of Operation Pakisa Ocean's Economy with key and primary stakeholders being uh, the Department of Higher Education and Training, SAMSA, Nelson Mandela University, and some industry uh, stakeholders. We are proud of the 10 years uh, in existence because we are taking the view that a lot has been achieved during this particular uh, period. So we can refer to certain milestones as an illustration of the point that we've just made uh, uh, above. One, we inherited a national cadetship program back in 2014. At the moment, we have repurposed that and have it as a national seafarer development program because it includes other elements except uh, officer training. These include an interest in sailing, yachting, and many other sub-disciplines that are associated with seafaring uh, its, itself. And parts of that, with the support of uh, institutions like TITA, were able to develop a framework for civil development uh, in, the, in the country. Not only have we focused on seafarer development, although it forms a bulk of the work that we do, but in pursuit of making sure that the country has got a professional workforce within the sector, we have had uh, about three programs there off. One of them has been to take in SIME a, a number of interns. Then secondly, partners such as SAMSA have come on board in hosting the interns so that the interns are not just a, a, a SAIMI activity but right across. We also have got a post-doctoral program that supports those that are, have completed their PhDs. On the other hand, we also have the Emerging Researchers program because we are creating a pipeline of researchers that would be able to sustain the sector uh, into the future. For skills development, we have had a particular focus on marine manufacturing. We had a pilot program at uh, Falls Bay College, and we have partnered with industry role players as well as uh, others to support the fisheries uh, 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 program, especially the fishing cooperatives that got uh, licenses from uh, the department at uh, DFFE. In terms of uh, research, we have tried to concentrate our efforts on the establishment of a SAIMI think tank, which is led by research experts. Part of uh, the work to center our work on research has been the establishment of a community of practice on oil and gas exploration uh, with a multitude of universities from VETS, Mandela, University of the Western Cape, uh, and, uh, and, and others. We are in the process with the NRF on the establishment of a research chair on naval architecture uh, and design. Hopefully by the end of this year we would be able to report on the results of that. Similarly, we're looking at a community of practice for aquaculture. We also have got uh, knowledge uh, product, products as well, such as the South African Channel for Maritime Education and Training. By the end of this year, as we celebrate our 10 years, we would uh, be on our third edition. We also have got a channel uh, called uh, Joga uh, as well that looks at uh, uh, policy development uh, on ocean governance uh, in particular. 
For purposes of a maritime innovation, we have got projects that we support at Mandela University as well as UCT. This is looking at capacity development, the registration of students at masters, PhD and postdoc, but also on supporting innovation through the development of uh, underwater gliders uh, as well as autonomous uh, vessels as well. So these are some of the things that we have looked at in respect of uh, uh, innovation. As part of the coordination work that we have here at SAIM is a maritime advocacy. There we have uh, worked with the departments of basic education in the provinces as well as nationally to support maritime high schools. The major achievement out of this is the accreditation of a teacher qualification at uh, UKZN which would enable these high schools to have professional teachers uh, 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 going forward. But part of maritime awareness, besides the maritime high schools, have been two programs, which is Learn to Swim and Learn to Sail. With this, we are confident that we would refine them and present you know, more steadier projects around this. In recognition of the need to have capacity in the space of uh, the local state, we have piloted in two provinces, KZN and Eastern Cape, uh, the true provision of workshops for traditional leaders as well as LED officials. With this, we are strengthening the capacity of the state to be able to support and understand uh, the ocean's uh, economy. But parts of it has been an effort to have the ocean's economy properly defined. We've completed uh, parts of that work, as well as going on to consider the size and the contribution of the ocean's economy to the national GDP. Because we are of the view that as we move forward, this would assist in strengthening the sector, people to understand what its contribution is. We've uh, also, as SAIMI, gone on further on internationalization and sought international partnerships. Some of uh, the staff members have just come back from a conference of the International Association of Maritime University. This is an effort to strengthen seafarer training in the, in the country. At the moment, there is an ocean economy master plan process uh, which is underway, and SAIMI have pay, paid its dues in supporting uh, uh, this particular process. Looking forward, we have signed some agreements with some Tivet uh, colleges to ensure that the maritime education and training features at the Tivet uh, uh, level. So these are just but some of the achievements for the past 10 years of SAIMI's existence. We're looking forward to better coordinated relations with key stakeholders within the site. So this call is also an invitation uh, to potential partners and existing partners as we march on to the next uh, decade.